Hello guys and welcome back to this channel, where today guys, I'll be showing you how to create and merge Zendex views. So guys, the first thing that you actually need to do is go to uh, the Zendex official website and then log into your profile. If guys, you do not have one, you can always go and register to Zendex. But guys, if you do not know how to do that, you can always go to our YouTube channel where you have plenty of how to Zendex videos where you can see how you can do this. Now guys, that we got that out of the way, let's see what we actually have in front of us here. So as you can see here, we have the Zendix uh, official website where you can go and first of all, get started and create some of the stuff on your account. So your ticketing system, you can assign your productivity, messaging and live chat, the help center, reporting and analytics, apps, and all of those things. Also in the left corner, you can go and here you can go and see everything about your tickets. So basically you can go see your install tickets, the pending tickets, uh, you can go click on one ticket. You can go edit it, merge it, mark it as spam, and go and delete the ticket. Also, in the customers uh, sector, we have your email. There are all of your customers and information about them. So you have your email, your name, and time zones, and all of those things. You have your organizations. And in the top right corner, you have everything about your account. So there you have, as you can see, your product updates. You can view your profile. You can get help. You can go to the support and help center, keyboard shortcuts, get feedback about the privacy and the sign out option but now guys let's see how you can create and manage zendex views so basically you just need to go and follow these few steps that i was telling you so you need to go to zendex and then click on workspaces then click on view and add view then click add conditions add required ticket conditions and add all required ticket conditions is the last thing you need to do so guys, that is everything for this video. I hope that you found it informative. If you did, don't forget to like this video, share it, subscribe to the channel, put the notifications on, and I'll be seeing you in the next video. Bye, guys.